A complete guide to parent visas for Australian permanent residents and citizens. If you're an Australian permanent resident or citizen and want to bring your parents to Australia, you have several visa options. Deciding the right visa depends on factors such as whether your parents seek a temporary stay or permanent residency, their age, and available funds. This video update explores eligibility criteria and processing times to help you make an informed decision. Topics discussed in today's video update. Temporary versus permanent parent visa options. Eligibility criteria for parent visas. Non-contributory parent visas, and we'll also talk about the contributory parent visas. So watch the full video till the end. Don't miss out on authentic immigration updates. Subscribe to our channel, press the bell icon, and share our videos with your friends and family on Facebook, WhatsApp, and X. Let's resume the video and tell you about the Temporary Parent Visa Subclass 870, Extended Family Visits. The Sponsored Parent Temporary Visa Subclass 870 allows parents to visit Australia for up to three or five years. This is perfect for parents who wish to spend extended time with family, such as after the birth of a grandchild. Unlike standard visitor visas, this visa offers a longer stay without requiring frequent renewals. Are you wondering about the eligibility criteria for parent visas? To apply for parent visas, the following eligibility criteria must be met. The applicant must be a parent of an Australian citizen or permanent resident. The applicant must pass the balance of family test, which means at least half of their children must live in Australia. An assurance of support is required, where an eligible person commits to financially support the parents. The applicant must meet health and character requirements. What's the non-contributory parent visas, subclass 103 and 804? For those who prefer lower visa application fees, the parent visa subclass 103 and the aged parent visa subclass 804 are options. However, processing times are lengthy, up to 30 years, which makes these visas less suitable for many families. Let's now talk about the contributory parent visas, Faster Permanent Residency Subclass 173, 143, and 884, 864. The contributory parent visas subclass 173, 143, and contributory aged parent visas subclass 884, 864, offer a faster path to permanent residency, with processing times of around 12 years. These visas come with higher government fees, but provide quicker outcomes than non-contributory options. Conclusion of today's video update. Choosing the right parent visa depends on your family's circumstances, including your parents' age, how long they plan to stay, and your financial situation. Whether you opt for a temporary or permanent visa, understanding the eligibility criteria and processing times will help you make an informed choice. Seeking professional advice is always recommended to ensure a smooth application process. We've come to the end of our video. Don't forget to share your opinion in the comments below. Thanks for watching today's update.